are in Water Valley, Mississippi, uh, where we're going to be working on five homes today. We're spread all throughout the uh, community doing various things from roofing to painting to uh, some siding. Uh, so we're very excited for the work we have ahead of us and are looking forward to getting out there. Putting a handicap uh, ramp for the lady who lives in this house and then we're going to paint our house and uh, uh, we'll probably have to report, uh, repair some of the uh, uh, wood siding uh, boards uh, at the bottom and uh, just get it so that the main thing is for the safety so she can get in and out of her house. See, right now, uh, now, her only way out is for someone to bump her wheelchair down those five steps over there. So our main thing is to get, get a ramp so she can get in and out of the house and then uh, get everything that uh, has already been repaired and not painted, uh, painted, and then uh, repair it or, or do all the painting that needs to be done. So that's, that's the main thing we'll try to do today. And, and here we're replacing some of the siding and also the softening. Uh, we're off to great start. We got most of it finished this morning. Uh, and hopefully this afternoon we'll get the rest finished and can get paint on there and uh, be able to call it a day. Uh, it's great. Uh, me and Ruth Ann over there, Ruth Ann and I, are over there uh, scraping paint off the top. I've been whacking on the side of the house. So it's been a fun day, getting all my energy out. My name is Alma Nicholson and I've been with the Fuller Center for about six, about five or six years now. And I just think it's a wonderful organization. Uh, I'm from the Cofferville area. We're representing the Fuller Center for Yalabusha County. Uh, and we cover three towns, which is Cofferville, Water Valley, and Oakland. And in the Cofferville area in 2011, we renovated about 14 houses just for that one area plus Water Valley and what we had done in Oakland. So I think it's a wonderful organization and I get joy out, you know, just from volunteering my time and helping people and then seeing how happy they are when we can renovate their houses and they just show so much gratitude for doing that. And that's that's a joy that you just can't replace. <laughs> and we're just happy to have you guys here from uh, all over. I can't say from one area, but we're just so happy to have you here. And we hope that we are making your stay comfortable and enjoyable as well. <laughs> Thank you for this fellowship of love that has come into our midst and into our community. You have to try all these cookies. Everything on this tray is good. I've tried all <laughs> Basically we were assigned to paint the kitchen and which we've done, we put down two coats of paint, uh, finished that up this afternoon and then Steve just arrived and we were going to help him put down the new, uh, the new floor. 
uh, so far he hasn't needed our help. He seems to be quite capable by himself. So, but I think, think the paint job looks pretty good. I think it's uh, uh, pretty happy with it. So. I'm Pauline Weaver and I've lived here 30 years. The house, uh, house had a bad roof and all these writers and all the neighbors have gotten together and put me a new roof on. And I just think that's so wonderful of all of them. And I just want them to know how much I appreciate it. Nice work being done here. This lady's been in her house for a couple of years, I understand, and has not been able to get out. So we hope to have this uh, ramp finished at least enough uh, for her to get down and uh, in the railing up as well. are back in Houston. We had a great day in Water Valley where we worked on five projects and got a lot of work done. Um, it was great to see the riders getting out there work on floor center projects. A lot of them, for a lot of them, it was their first time doing it, so it was uh, great to see them getting their experience with the floor center. We also had an amazing potluck uh, dinner. Uh, most food I think I've ever seen. Uh, well, I don't even think we ate half half of it. Uh, but no, it was great uh, to be able to eat with the congregation there and a uh, lady sang for us and we also got a proclamation from the state representative, uh, which was very exciting. Uh, and all, it was a great day. I'm looking forward to getting back on the bike tomorrow, another 75 mile day, and we have two biking days left. <laughs>